Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuveer. In this class, we will discuss about circular tour gas station problem. The explanation is completely based on the assumption you already have some basic coding knowledge. If you are not good at basic coding, please watch our website learningmonkey.in. Take the course placement training for service based companies, then come for the competitive coding. Coming to today's class, so assume there is a circle. There are n petrol stations in that circle and you are given two arrays of size n. First one shows the petrol in the gas station, each gas station, how many liters of petrol available in that gas station. That is what the first array shows. And second array shows the distance from the present gas station to the next gas station. That is what the distance is. One liter is enough to travel one unit distance. So this is the condition they have provided. Find the starting point from where a truck can start and complete a circle. It has to complete a cycle without exhausting its petrol. This is what we need to do. And with example, you are going to understand it better. So take an example, the petrol bunks and uh, distances are provided so the first petrol station how much petrol available four liters of petrol available what is the distance from here to the second petrol station six kilometers I assume it, it may be kilometers or miles it's up to you six units of distance so is it possible by using this using this petrol is it possible to move from this gas station to the next gas station no so we are not supposed to start our truck here. Assume, assume, if, if the, in the second condition, if you start your truck from the second gas station, what is the petrol available here? Six. How much distance we have to travel to the next gas station? Five. What is the remaining amount? One liter available in our truck. So when you move from here to here, what is the petrol available? Seven. How much distance to here? 3, 7 minus 3, how much remain? 4, previously how much? 1, 4 plus 1, 5 liters remain in our tank, truck tank. So we move from here to here. How, what is the petrol available? 4 liters, 5 plus 4, 9 liters available. What is the distance we are traveling? 5. So from here we are moving to the first gas station again. So 9 minus 5, what is the available in our truck? 4. So 4 plus 4. 8. What is the distance we have to travel to come here? 6. So we can make a cycle if you start at the second gas station. This is what we need to identify. So where we have to start? We need to start at the second gas station. Because this is an array, index starts from 0, 1, 2 and 3. That's why our output is 1. Second gas station means index value is 1. But you need to maintain a time complexity of big O of n. You have to change, take only n. n means number of uh, gas stations in the cycle. And a space complexity of big O of 1 means some constant. This is what we need to maintain. Now we are going to understand the logic. Logic is simple to write. With the, uh, so if this condition is not there, time complexity, writing the logic is very very easy. Start from the first position, check the cycle. If it is possible, do it. Otherwise, start from the second position, check the cycle. Third position, check the cycle. Fourth position, check the cycle. For this, we need a nested loop. Nested loop means n square times. But we need to do it in a time complexity of n. How we do that? In order to do that, we are maintaining three variables. Start, deficit and some value. So what's these variables? Let's try to understand. We are starting from initially 0. So initially start is equal to 0. Deficit is equal to 0. Sum is equal to 0. So when, when we start here, what is the petrol we have? 7 liters. 7 minus 4. How much? 3 available. That is what sum says. Deficit means if you are in negative balance, that is what deficit. So we don't have any negative balance here. 3 means positive side, that's why deficit is equal to 0. So we move from here to the next position. So what's the available? 5. Previously how much is remaining? 3. 3 plus 5, 8. 8 minus 4, how much? 4. That is what the summation means. 
still we are in positive sides that's why deficit is equal to zero now coming to the next we moved from here to here what is the value 4 plus 4 previously we are having 4 liters now we are having 4 liters 4 plus 4 8 8 minus 9 we have to move 9 units we are in deficit minus 1 when you start from here you, you cannot go through from here to here so you can you are not going to start from here if you start from here you you, are, you stop it here if you start from here you are going to stop here if you start from here you are going to stop here so that's why your starting position should be from here to third position c so up to here what is the starting position zero 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 from here onwards what is the starting position third position because we are having a deficit of minus one here now our starting position should be from here okay this is what the logic uh, now again so your summation should be zero from here whenever there is a deficit make summation zero move our starting position to the next position so again start 8 minus 3 how much is the summation 5 and we are moving a what is the deficit value minus 1 we are moving a one step 7 minus 4 previously how much is there 5 5 plus 7 7 plus 5 how much is it is 7 minus 4 means 3 5 plus 3 means what is the we are in we are in plus 8 8 plus so this is the 8 value we are moving from here to here 6 minus 2 how much 4 previously how much remaining 8 8 plus 4 which is 12 once we completed all this when you come up to here what is the what is the positive petrol we are having 12 liters so what is the deficient value deficit value minus 1 so if you move from here to back 12 plus minus 1 how much it is we are in positive means if you start from here you can make a cycle you can make a cycle when you come to the end deficit plus sum if it is negative you cannot make a cycle you cannot make a cycle that is the logic that is the logic we need to follow means what is the deficit value from before and what is the summation how much plus we are from here to here if both if you add the both it should be positive if it is negative means we are in a we are in deficit value we cannot make a cycle if you cannot make a cycle return it as minus one if you can make a cycle what is the starting position from where you can start from third index value you can start and make a cycle maybe there is a chance if you start from four also you can make a cycle but the start the first starting position you have to display so this is the logic we are going to follow and uh, coming to the coding part uh, by listening to the logic you try to solve it on your own that is the best uh, uh, best thing you have to do and uh, the code is available in our website you can copy and use the code anyhow okay this is the coding part it's very very simple hope you understand the logic if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel Please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.